There are so many things that I could say to future judges, young girls and women who aspire to be judges. I could talk about the importance of the work itself and the importance of balancing it all. I could talk about the people we serve in court or the people we serve in our communities or even the work-life balance that we so desperately need and deserve. But I'd like to offer advice in some areas that could apply to us all across different areas in our lives. I would advise you to listen more than you speak. In my mind, no two cases are the same. While we may see very similar scenarios throughout our time on the bench, it's very important to remember that no two cases and no two people are the same. We should give each case our undivided attention, regardless of how familiar we are or are not with a specific topic. Remember, this is what we do for a living, not those who come before us. Active listening and patience help us to recognize issues and concerns that may not otherwise be known to the court. Issues such as abuse, mental health, and homelessness, all issues and things that we can and should consider. I think it's important to make sure that people understand the role of the court and the expectations up front. For me, it helps in creating rapport throughout the courtroom among those involved, and it helps to create appropriate decorum in the courtroom. Never stop learning and work hard to keep up with technologies and solutions that aid individuals and assist in creating efficiencies for our courts in general. Being a judge can sometimes feel lonely. Be sure to treat your clerks, your bailiffs, facility staff, and your judicial assistants well. There is no substitute for feeling safe, well-informed, and appreciated by others. Finally, do unto others as you would have them do unto you. As judges, we should always remain fair, firm, and focused. Best wishes to you as you endeavor upon your new, exciting, and meaningful journey. Thank you.